Hello everyone, and welcome to my Duel Today official news channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. According to Days of Our Live spoilers on Wednesday, August 30, Dimitri von Lushner and Gwen von Lushner will return to Salem following their brief honeymoon in Iceland. Dimitri will consequently prove the legitimacy of his marriage to Elliot Roth, Darren Richardson, by putting on quite a show. Dimitri will confront a difficult decision as he tries to manage all of this since, of course, Gwen could become suspicious if she learns more about the specifics of Dimitri's inheritance. Dimitri will have to deal with each issue as it arises since Kristen DeMero will very certainly reveal the truth about his fictitious marriage which will make things worse. Leo Stark will also visit Salem in the interim, where he will run meet Sonny Kyriakis. According to today's spoilers, Sonny will catch up with Leo and probably think he's planning something based on his evasive demeanor. On Wednesday's DOO episode, Gabby Demera and Stefan Demera will collaborate to uncover Kristen's hidden information regarding Dimitri. That will include speaking with Elliot as Stefan and Gabby Pry. Since Rachel Black is aware of the information, Stefan will also try to get her to share it. Day's rumors indicate that Stefan will suggest continuing the game of 20 questions where Gabby left off, but it appears like Kristen will thwart his idea. Regardless, Stefan and Gabby will keep looking for the truth and may eventually learn that Kristen is extorting money from Dimitri because of his relationship with Leo, which might cost him millions of dollars because his marriage is illegitimate. Alex Kyriakis will have some guilt as he considers Victor Kyriakis passing, according to other day's spoilers. Alex might be concerned that Victor was disappointed in him because he left Titan. Alex will receive some help after again interfering with Chad DeMera and Stephanie Johnson's privacy, and he might decide certain job adjustments are in his future. Days of our live spoilers indicate that Peacock recently committed a mistake and momentarily released the incorrect episode too early. But their oversight benefited viewers eager to learn more about Dick Van Dyke's enigmatic character. Marlena Evans asks John Black in that leaked episode for assistance in identifying both this man and his long-lost son. Even though Van Dyke's character is missing many memories, he can at least recall that he is looking for a son he has never met, and that son is probably close. According to his dog tags, this man is named Joseph Bell, and he has a remarkable link to John. This could be the beginning of a significant family mystery being solved. Fans of Dades will recall that John's past has undergone numerous revisions over the years, which has resulted in significant alterations to his family history as well. Based on the leaked information, which suggests that Joseph served in the same army unit as the guy now thought to be John's father, Timothy Robichoke's alias Yo Ling. It appears that Days is preparing for another significant change. It all adds up to a DOL rewriting when you take into account Joseph's advanced age, the quest for his son, and this intimate connection to the man who everyone assumes is John's biological father. There will probably be a startling father-related surprise that reveals John to be the long-lost son Joseph is yearning for. Perhaps in a case of mistaken identity or identity theft, Joseph Bell is Timothy Robichokes. We can't completely rule out the possibility that the day's authors are deliberately confusing the audience. The simplest explanation, however, is often the correct one in soap operas, so that might be the case in this instance. How do you feel about the shocking revelation of John's biological father? Do you appreciate the thought of John's biological father ultimately becoming Dick Van Dyke's character? We'll provide updates on John's devastating revelation because days of our live spoilers indicate he'll keep looking for answers. According to days of our live spoilers, Sloane Peterson may decide to drown her sorrows now that she has lost the child and may never be able to conceive again. Of course, Sloane also has a lot of guilt to deal with as a result of the falsified DNA test, the altered genetic results, and all the lies she told Eric Brady, temporarily portrayed by Jason Gerhardt. During the week of September 4 to 8, 
Sloane will be tempted to give Eric the whole truth, but she'll surely hold back. Day's teasers indicate that Sloane might make up another justification to hide her almost admittance, but maybe she'll end up telling someone else. Since Melinda Trask, Tina Huang, already knows Sloane's secret and has sworn to remain silent, perhaps Days will divulge the information to someone and cause a minor conundrum for another Salamite. The complex relationship between Sloane and Alex Kyriakis might be brought up at this point. Fans of DOL will remember that when Sloane first arrived in Salem, Alex and Sloane were hookup partners. Later, tension increased when Alex deceived Sloane into finding documents stashed in Sloane's flat. However, according to today's teasers, Sloane will only be able to concentrate on her lie and how much harm she is causing at this point. Sloane will be heartbroken to believe that she is depriving Eric of his child with Nickel Walker, Ariane Sucker, but she will be tenacious in her pursuit of holding on to him. Alex might run across Sloane in the bar since he is depressed over Victor Kyriakis' passing and is feeling guilty over earlier errors. That might cause Sloane and Alex to share a drink and commiserate. Alex might be honest with Sloane about what it's like to live next to Stephanie Johnson and perhaps even confess that he was trying to ruin her relationship with Chad Demira. What if Sloane spills her dirty little secret to Alex when she is intoxicated, that she tampered with the paternity of his child? Given that Eric, Nicole, and E.J. Demera are all impacted by such a significant deception, would Alex maintain silence? Alex would be in an interesting predicament, so perhaps they will get drunk and have a secret conversation that transforms everything. Days of Our Lives spoilers indicate that on September 7, a well-known figure will return to Salem. Saad claims that Rachel Melvin will play Chelsea Brady once more when she attends Victor Kyriakis' funeral, adding yet another returning figure to John Aniston's memorial. From 2005 to 2009, Melvin portrayed Bo Brady and Billy Reed's kid, therefore she frequently appeared in exhilarating situations with Aniston and greatly adored him. In fact, Rachel Melvin expressed to Martha Madison that she wanted to honor Aniston after his passing. The returning Dio Olo star believes that may have contributed to the later call. After some time, Melvin's manager brought updates from Days because they wanted Chelsea Brady to return for a memorial episode. Melvin responded enthusiastically since she was eager to take part in Victor's grand departure. Of course, for the time being, this is just a brief cameo but may Chelsea make a lengthier presence in the future. Once Bo eventually comes out of his coma, it would be good to have Chelsea back for a true storyline. No matter what, Chelsea will visit days for Victor's burial and speak movingly about how much her grandfather meant to her. There will be some difficult times when Chelsea and her loved ones reflect on the power Victor once possessed. Days will undoubtedly continue to provide flashbacks as they assist fans in saying farewell to Victor and his illustrious one-liners. Victor will be remembered for his wit, his tenacious business methods, and the compassion he held for those who were close to him. Are you anticipating Rachel Melvin's return to the role of Chelsea Brady? Would you like to see any additional large returns in the future? Stay with us for more information on Victor's funeral and what lies next for his family since Days of Our Lives spoilers indicate that John Aniston's tribute will surely be worth watching for. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any updates.